Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. I am so excited that you are here or welcome to the channel if you are brand new. And if you are new, drop new down in the comments because I want to say hi to you. I want to welcome you. I'm so excited for you to be here. And I appreciate you all so, so much for watching. It's Jody Dunn coming at you with a midweek Walgreens haul. And we're doing the giveaway. We are drawing for the giveaway winner. I'm so excited. All right, so I'm gonna take you into Walgreens with me. I snapped some pictures and go over the deals. I'm doing one deal really focusing on some items that I needed for the household that also qualified for Ibotta rebates. So that's basically gonna be my first transaction. And I will tell you, I was able to snag some more of the Papermate deal. I was so excited, but I couldn't get any pictures or anything. If you've been following along at all, I think you already know that the Walgreens um, Papermate deal is holy crap amazing this week. If you can find them, most of my stores were cleared out. I tried a different store and that is where I snagged a bunch of stuff. Um, so it's like a money maker, a big money maker if you can find the cheap ones. So anyways, let's go into the store. Then I'll bring you back to my kitchen table and show you all of the stuff that I got. We are seriously paper mate wasted in this house right now. We have so much dang paper mate. And make sure that you stay tuned through the video and I am going to insert a clip where we are drawing for the winner. So I need you to get back to me within three days. I will put my email. It's going to be down below. I'll also pop it up on the screen. I need you to email me. And I want to thank everyone so, so very much from the bottom of my heart that entered, that subscribed, that is liking the videos, that is commenting on the videos. I just can't even express how much I appreciate your support. It means the world to me. And I want you to know that you're showing up for me. You're supporting me and my channel and I'm going to keep showing up for you. So this is one of many giveaways. I'm excited. We're going to do the next giveaway as soon as we hit a thousand subscribers. And you guys, we are not that far off. I can't even believe it. All right, so stay tuned. Let's go in the store. Let's grab our stuff. Let's go over it. And then we're going to announce the winner. Okay, the first thing I am going to pick up is this Nivea Men's Shave Gel. It is buy one, get one 50% off. They're priced at $3.49 in my store, bringing that total to $5.23 for both. I have a $2 manufacturer coupon off of each, which is going to bring that down to $1.23. And Ibotta is giving me back $1.60 on each one, making this a $1.96 moneymaker. Oh my gosh, I was so excited to find this at this Walgreens, the Viva Multi-Surface, and it actually is on clearance at the store for $8.49. I found out after I got home that it actually rang up for just $8. There's an Ibotta rebate for $1.50 and Fetch Rewards was giving back $2 rebate or 2,000 points. So I was super excited to pick this up. I had a 75 cent off coupon. So after coupon, $1.50 rebate from Ibotta and $2 from Fetch that brought this paper towel down to just $3.75. For Viva Paper Towel, I think that is an amazing deal. Okay, I found some paper mate in this store that I visited. However, I have an update for you, so stick around. But this was the next item that I picked up. It is the Cottonelle. It's on sale for $5.99, and I have an Ibotta rebate for a dollar back on this. I also have a 55 cent off coupon that I printed off of scottbrand.com. So after rebate and coupon, that's going to bring this down to $4.35. 
last item for this transaction because you know I'm stocking up on register rewards for next week's beauty event. The Alme wipes are buy one, get one 50% off. So they're $5.99. So two of them is going to cost you $8.98. I have a $3 off manufacturer coupon, bringing that down to $5. You're going to get back a $5 register reward. So bringing that down to just 98 cents or 49 cents each. Okay, here is the update that I just heard about the Papermate deal. I didn't take a picture because there was a couple other people in there trying to get the deal and it was a little bit crazy. I'll go over that with you when I show you my haul. But I just heard that the deal is dead as far as receiving the 2,000 points for each pack. So they are resetting it. I don't know if it will still work in your store as of now. I'm not even going to try it because all my stores are wiped out anyways. But what I heard is they are going to be buy one, get one free, but you're going to get back just 2,000 points for buying too. So just a heads up, if you are wanting to go out and pick up some more, I hope you all were able to take advantage of it while it was the 2,000 points for each pack. But I just got an update on that. So I wanted to share it. Here we are back at the kitchen table. I did another Walgreens haul today. This actually was not exactly what I had planned, but we're rolling with it. Um, if you caught my video on Sunday about the Papermate deal, I know everybody's talking about it. Um, I did not actually realize when I did the original deal that it was going to be a moneymaker deal. And I have been trying to find more and everybody's shelves are cleared because <laughs> people are really taking advantage of this deal, which is great. Like we should all be able to take advantage of the deals. So I actually did drive 20 minutes today to a store that I have actually never been to because another store told me they had stock. And so I went there and I'm paper made wasted omg all right let me go over what i did with you today at walgreens and stick around because we are going to announce the winner of the gift card giveaway i am so dang excited all right so my first transaction i went down the supplies area and basically there wasn't a whole lot there was a ton of pens you guys a ton and these are $2.99 buy one get one free and for buying two you're gonna get 4,000 points so I did stock up on some pens because I didn't get really any pens last time I really wanted to get the pen. I'm popping in to interrupt your regularly scheduled programming because we got to announce the winner of the giveaway so I'm giving away a $15 gift card and a couple of items as well. I want to show you. I have a couple beauty items. I'm going to pop in your box. Um, a mascara, an eyeliner, some makeup remover wipes. And if you already have one of these, you can give it to somebody else or maybe you need a, a spare. I have a little accordion style coupon holder. I have the same one in a different color that I take into the store with me. So I'm not bringing my huge binder. So I'm going to put this in your gift as well. And you're getting a $15 gift card to your choice of Walgreens or CVS. You need to let me know. And here's what I decided to do, you guys, because there were so many people that entered. And I don't know that I'll do this every time, but I'm just so excited and I'm so grateful. I'm doing two winners. So that is for the first winner. And the second winner is going to get a $10 gift card to your choice of Walgreens or CVS. All right, so I'm going to pop it up on the screen. You entered by making sure that you were subscribed to my channel, by liking the video, and leaving a comment. So here's the first comment on the screen. Donna Smith, you are a winner. I'm so excited for you. Make sure you send me an email with your mailing address so I can get this out to you as soon as possible. And I need to know if you prefer a Walgreens gift card or a CVS gift card. And the second winner of the $10 either Walgreens or CVS gift card is right up on the screen here, Jamie Thornton. Oh my gosh, my 
ladies, congratulations. Thank you so, so much. I'm excited to get you your gifts. And thank you to everybody that entered. Make sure that you stay tuned. Make sure you click that bell notification because I will be doing more giveaways in the future. And hopefully we'll be doing another gift card giveaway very, very soon. Okay, back to back to the, the stuff, the Walgreens stuff. I really wanted to get the pencils. They only had two packages out, which I actually found like not even in the right spot. They were just laying down. And I did want to pick up some Sharpies because these were not a moneymaker here, but I knew I was making money with this and this is something that we need and use. So, all right. I, I was going to do two transactions. Here's what I got. My first transaction, really, I wanted to focus on a couple of household things I needed. Grab another register reward for next week's beauty event. And I have a couple of Ibotta rebates that I wanted to take advantage of. So I picked up the Nivea, which was a great money maker for me, made me about two bucks. The Alme wipes again to get my $5 register reward. The Viva multi-surface cloth, which is a great rebate on Ibotta and Fetch Rewards, was actually on sale at the Walgreens that I went to. And then this Cottonelle was on sale as well and another Ibotta rebate. So let's go over my receipt. So the Nivea Shave Gel is buy one, get one half price. Like I said, I made between my Ibotta rebates and the coupons I had about $2 on that deal. The Almay Wipes, they are buy one, get one 50% off. Buy two and you get a $5 register reward. The Cottonelle was on sale for $5.99. The Viva was on sale. Ooh, I just noticed it was only $8. The tag in the store was a little bit more than $8. Now I'm even more excited. So the Viva was $8 on the nose. At Walmart, it's $9.98, I think. All right, so I had $2 off um, coupons for the Nivea, which I already showed you that in the store. I had a 75 cent off coupon for the Viva and a $3 off coupon for the um, Alme Wipes. And then I had a 55 cent printable coupon that I printed on scottbrand.com for the um, Cottonelle. So that brought my subtotal to $19.90. And I redeemed 20,000 points, so I paid $1.59, which was basically my tax, um, out of pocket in cash. I started with 77,000 points. I earned everyday reward points. I actually hit beauty in this transaction for purchasing the Alme Wipes because I was close to beauty. And so I just redeemed 20,000, and my closing balance is 6,220 points. Then we get Paper Mate Wasted. I thought this was going to be the only transaction I did. So these are $1.99 BOGO. These were $3.49 BOGO. These were $4.49 BOGO. And you get 2,000 points back for every package that you purchase, whether they are BOGO or not. Real quick on this transaction, I meant to get that $5 register reward, the store register reward that they're giving. We ended up having to void my transaction because it just wouldn't, I typed in my phone number three times and it wouldn't take it. And so we had to void it and redo it. And the cashier forgot to scan the flyer again. So I didn't get, I should have, I spent over $25 here. So I should have got that $5 store reward. Not a biggie because I was so thrilled after what happened on this one. Okay, so I'm checking out. Here's my receipt. We've got the highlighters at $4.49, the mechanical pencils at $3.49, BOGO, and then all the pens at $2.99. I did use, I had her scan on this one, I remembered, so I'd get that register reward. My total was, hmm, sorry. I thought I gave her a $5 register reward to use on this one. Oh, I did. It's right there. OMG. I gave her a $5 register reward that was expiring in two days that I earned like almost two weeks ago to bring down my out-of-pocket. So my to my subtotal was $20.32. I used 22 or I used $20 in points again and paid um, my tax in cash. So $2.48 for my tax. 
I earned 32,000 points for buying all that paper, mate. Redeemed 20,000. So we started with 62,000, ending with 74,250 points. As I was checking out, the manager comes up to the register and says, do you want any more pencils? And I was like, oh, what? You have more pencils? I'm like, I had to get a bunch of pens because you didn't have any pencils. She was like, oh yeah, I have a ton more. They're in the back. Let me go grab them. She sets them on the counter for me. There was a couple of other ladies there too, you guys, that were looking for this deal. One lady spent over $100 in paper, mate, and she's donating, which I'm going to be donating some of this as well. But I will tell you, we go through these a ton. My girls love the mechanical pencils. So I'm going to be donating some of them to the school and some of the pens, and then we're going to keep them because I know that we go through them so much. I could have gotten more. They had so many more pens, but I just didn't want to, like I wanted to save some of it for other people. And the pens are not going to last forever. The mechanical pencils will last for quite a while. The pens will dry out eventually. And I don't know how much the elementary school uses ink pens. I will donate most of these, but I know that they um, use pencils more and they didn't have nearly as much pencils as possible. But I said, you know, I don't want to clear your shelves. And they were like, go ahead and clear our shelves. We don't care. They were so amazing. So I wasn't even upset at all about losing that $5 store register reward for my first transaction. I did get the store register reward for my second transaction right here. So I ended up picking up another $25. I had to add a candy on to bring my total to $25 in Paper Mate pencils. So these are all the mechanical pencils. So not as much of a money maker as the pens are because they're $3.49. So they're about a 50 cent money maker. I'm perfectly great with that. So here goes all of my buy one, get one mechanical pencils and the 79 cent chocolate. I had her scan that booster again. I used another $5 register reward to bring down my out of pocket. My total was $20.22. I used 20,000 in points to pay, paid $1.59 out of cash for my tax. So we started with 74,250 points. We earned 28, we redeemed 20, and we are now at 82,300 points. And I did get another $5 store register reward. So super exciting day, totally paper mate wasted. The numbers work out like this. I spent $5.76 in cash. I used $10 in register rewards to pay for all of this stuff. And I used 60,000 in points to pay for all of this stuff. I got back $10 in store register rewards, $5 in manufacturer register rewards because they are different. And I earned 65,180 points. So in total, this was a $10.94 moneymaker for me based on what I spent and everything I got back, including my Ibotta rebates and my Fetch Reward rebates. Because I got, um, Ibotta gave me a dollar for the Cottonelle, a dollar fifty for the Viva, a dollar sixty for one, each one of these. And um, Fetch Rewards gave me $2 for the Viva. So if you were just going out to do the paper mate deal, this would have been a humongous money maker for me, but I wanted to pick up some household needs. And again, I wanted to stock up on register rewards for next week for our beauty event. So making $10 and 79 cent, 94 cents on all of this stuff is pretty dang amazing. There's Gus in the background. Do you want to say hello, Gus? No, he doesn't like the camera. <laughs> I hope you guys got some value out of this video. Let me know if you have any questions. Were you able to pick up the paper mate deal? I'm crossing my fingers that you were because I know most of the stores in my area were completely wiped out once people realized what a big money maker it was. And again, I could have probably spent another $50 on just pens and I would have got back a lot of points and I definitely love taking advantage of deals like that. However, 
I just didn't, like, I didn't want to clear the shelf. I wanted to save it for somebody else that maybe hasn't had an opportunity. I spent $40. To me, that was plenty. I earned a ton more points than I spent, even with spending $20 in points on this transaction right here, which gave me back no points, which is why this is the game of drugstore couponing. We use our points to buy things that we want and need, we use our points to turn them into register rewards. We use our register rewards to turn them into points so that we can use the store's money to shop, which I absolutely adore the fact that we can do that. All right, thanks so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing if you enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys on the next one. And super huge congratulations to the winner of the giveaway. Please make sure that you send me an email within three days so that I can get your prize out to you. If I don't hear from you, then I will choose somebody else. So please make sure that you email me within the three days. I will talk to you guys soon.